and welcome to my channel Hisame Artwork. For my old subscribers, this video is going to be a little different from my usual tutorial reviews and art streams. Uh, but this is a project that I've worked a lot on the graphics. So here it is, the House Tour Spring Edition. Um, first of all, I'm gonna turn on the music. Hope you can still hear me okay with that. For those that don't know, um, Stardew Valley is a RPG farming simulator and dungeon crawler. I've used a lot of mods on my game and the links will be in the description below. I have customized some of the mods. You may not find the exact item you are looking for, therefore I've added some uh, tutorial links so that you too can learn how to personalize uh, your mods or make uh, an entirely new mod by yourself not sure exactly how well the sound is here just turn it a little bit lower just to be sure you guys can still hear me so this one here works just like the spa in the mountains so here this is kind of my dressing area. I have my hats here. And my shoes. And up here is the get dressed mod. So this has more advanced features. And you can save all of these and you have extra room here to save them. calendar over there, decorations for each season, this is a table and I have here you can put items on the table, ice cream machine because I like ice cream a lot and I can eat this. Um, this is Carmila's uh, uh, retextured cellar. I can choose the music here. Hope you can still hear it okay. And I have Jojo Cola here and other goodies I can eat. I can't. I can't wait to get the multiplayer so I can have uh, friends come over here and see this as well. Uh, I have some extra for the fridge here. I have a mod that increases the size of the fridge. Ah, wanted. Uh, these are the recipes that I have. I have the uh, butcher mod installed. The meat mod is now called. This is a fireplace. I've retextured it to look like a pizza oven. This is my music area. I have decorations for each season here. Uh, this is the game room. TV works. Um, arcades work as well. Uh, this is the children's room. Uh, this is my pride and joy. I worked so much on this one. I had to edit the house tile sheets, which uh, was a bit of a challenge. But I managed to get everything. And here is a, um, um, a fishbowl. This is a craftable item. It is a mod. So I have the mod installed and now I can make... Um, uh, these are other machines. Now I can make the fishbowl, so you can find it here. And these is ch butter churn, hay dryer, and so on. You can get those from mods as well. Here is my office. More decorations here. The desk. Furniture catalog. Wallpaper catalog. I've retextured these. I've taken from other mods or just made my own. 
TV works as well. Um, I have a camera here from one mod, treasure chest is vanilla, just a whole bunch of combinations. I made a Okami statue and a Tufla statue, a uh, whole bunch of other things. This is kind of my mining area, my fighting area, and my fishing area. And you can take these and put them on the table. Flower pots. Textured. I made myself a um, star drop tree. It's actually a green plush seat that I've retextured. Um, and now I'm going to show you guys the uh, Neko Cafe. And I can take a shortcut through here actually. You can see all of these are connected in the farm tour. The video is already up on YouTube. The slimes are, are finally getting together. I initially put the green and red and they just didn't want to combine, but now you see there's a great love between them. And here it is, the Neko Cafe. So for both the house and the uh, Neko Cafe, I took inspiration from the Pelish Castle, which is a Bavarian style castle uh, built by the Hohenzollern family in my country, Romania. Uh, this is the first floor. I have kind of like a little shopping area here. Uh, and I can sell uh, decorations, tea, milk, uh, cookies, a whole bunch of other things. Up here I have like a fake uh, little greenhouse. Um, again, items, you can put them on the, um, the, the end tables, they're called. Uh, here's a little bee house, it will make uh, honey, but only wild honey. Here is where I have the decorations. And down below... Is kind of a restaurant, music, a library, Neko Cafe <laughs> mix. And this looks really nice in the evening, so I am going to uh, fiddle a bit with the time here. Hopefully, it will not crash the game. Oh, what was it? P, time, time, time. Okay, so now it's uh, dark. I'm gonna show you guys how it looks inside with all of the mood lighting and down below. I just love it. Um, the lights here really stand out and I have like a darker area here and it would be really nice once we have the multiplayer uh, and the custom NPC mod working that we can have somebody come and sing here like maybe Abigail and Sam and Sebastian can come and sing for us and we can listen to them sing every week. That would be an awesome mod to have. Just hire someone to come and sing in your cafe. So now I'm gonna go to the house and show you guys how the house looks. Um, almost there. The farm's pretty big. It takes a while to get from one place to the other. But I just love it. I have everything I ever wanted in a farm right at my fingertips. So this is how the house looks at night. And I made sure to leave some places uh, on lit. The cat's in the way. And here we go, can go to sleep now. Bye bye everyone!